So EA dropped year in review player picks. These are the player picks that you can get SBC cards from December, January, and February in. Let's open this up and see what we get. We are getting not bad if I didn't already have them, to be fair. If you guys want cheap, fast, and reliable foot coins, check out u7buy.com. There is a link in the description down below. And make sure to use the code HABER to get yourself 6% off all of your purchases. This Vanderson's not an awful card. I'm going to take him. But if I didn't already have DRB, that would be a class card to get. Because Leverkusen, I think, are still in the Europa League. We'll go ahead and store Vanderson. Let's go and open some more. All right. Next year in review player pick now. Let me know in the comments down below what you guys get in your year in review player picks. And also leave a like on the video if you guys do enjoy. Subscribe if you guys are new around here. Uh, amazing support on yesterday's uh, video. It was insane. But this is not a terrible player pick here. Timber's actually a pretty good card to be fair. As a CDM centre middle cam. I think that's a small W. He is very usable. All right, Amy wants to pick Timber from uh, this SBC, which is fair enough. I think he's a decent card. Uh, he's definitely usable as well, in my opinion, because realistically, there'll be more decent Dutch players, won't there? There'll be more decent Dutch cards. Um, so I think he's definitely usable. And also, we have a foot birthday team one player. Can we get like a Darwin? One of the new new release cards? Spanish? Oh, I thought it might have been Koke, but it's Uri. That is a bit of an L, unfortunately. All right, next year in review player pick for uh, Dan now. Here we go. Come on. Vanderson again. Vanderson's not bad. I've been told that he's apparently really good at right back, but I, th I think the other version of him, the right back version, is a little bit better actually at right back. The rest of it's not ideal. I feel like for this player pick, you're not looking for the most valuable players, but you're looking for like players that you haven't completed that maybe fit your team a little bit later on. All right, next year in review player pick now. Ivory Toast is the club name. Can we get our first W, like proper W? Fabio Vieira is not bad. Definitely fits his team. He's running a Premier League team or a majority Premier League team. Fabio Vieira is not an awful card to get. Um, yeah, I think honestly, like... I think we'll take Fabio Vieira. I think that's all right. I mean, obviously, Mendes is out of Europa League now, so it doesn't really matter for that card. Yeah, Vieira is a small W, I'd say. We have got Stevo's year in review player pick next. Come on, let's get a good card. Ooh, Gareth Bale. I thought Mkhitaryan was pretty decent until Gareth Bale popped up. Bale's a big W, in my opinion. I don't think that was a super expensive card, but the fact you didn't have him and he's 93 rated is a dub. We'll take that. Bale's solid. He's also got his 85 times 10, which, hey, I'm saying like we have the mini release for, ooh, Kimmich in an 81 double. Or was that an 81 double or 75 double? I don't even know. Um, We have the new release. Obviously, you have Darwin Nunes. You've got Koke. You've got Zinchenko. Then you have Foot Birthday Team 1 and you also have Foot Birthday Icons. Foot Birthday, let's go. French, no, it's bad, isn't it? Oh, why? My brain is is been taught that French is good, but it's it's not in this regard because there's no good French ones. Ooh, two foot, but uh, it's not. Look, it's not great. I can't lie to you. Actually, that's not a great pack. It's not that. It's okay. It's pretty mid, I'd say. All right, Max's year in review next. Hotel Tiago, pretty good club name. That I like that. Although I'm not a big fan of this stadium, mate. No, don't like it. All right, here we go. Come on, let's get play of the month Rashford. Can you get playing them with Rashford? I think you can. I hope you can. If it'll even want to open. Oh, <laughs> scammed. You got scammed. EA just scammed you, bro. Oh, that's rough. That is, that is crazy. This is the real EA IQ test. All right, Max is finally back in the game. Here we go. Small Dini. No, I'm not even going to try and pretend that's good. All right, we have an 85 times 10 and a 1 of 4 year in review player pick. Here we go. Vonderson right back's nice. Osmond play the most okay. The right back card's very nice though. That is a really good right back apparently. Danny Ceballos upgraded. Uh, you want Danny Ceballos? Really? Okay, fair enough. You have the other Vonderson already. Fair play, man. We'll take Danny Ceballos. Is this card like... I suppose it's not a bad card to be fair. All right, fair play. You can get a vet course on this? Yeah, I know. Yeah, fair enough. I mean, some of the best cards you can get like flashback Mane uh, for birthday. Oh, sorry. Birthday. Uh, play of the month in Bappe. Um, I think it's flashback Pogba as well. You can get like Ramos as well. So there's some decent cards you can get. All right, we have my boy Lala's uh, year in review player pick next. Let's go. Ooh, Mares is not bad, you know. Centurions Mares, or you've got a choice of Locatelli as well. Rodrigo's okay. Rodrigo's not awful. Uh, no, Rodrigo's bad. Rodrigo's bad. But no, I don't think that's awful. To be fair. I think Mars is pretty good. 
Go Locatelli? Really? Oh, fair enough. All right. Well, he, well, Locatelli's actually pretty good, to be fair. We'll take the Locatelli for him. Fair play. I mean, that was a nice SBC, in my opinion. A nice a nice player pick. All right, next year in review player pick. We've not had one of the top dogs yet, but we've had a few, like, I would say, small Ws like Locatelli and people like that. I think they're, like, small Ws, in my opinion. Like, they're okay. They're decent cards, but they're not worth loads. I thought, I don't know why... That was so stupid of me. I thought we just got Alfonso Davies. I'm like, since when did Alfonso Davies have a card? Apparently that Reese Oxford is actually, like, class. Apparently he's an incredible card. Sawloth looks like a powerhouse. But again, no expensive cards, unfortunately. 85 times 10 now. Here we go. Come on. Can we get a foot birthday icon dangler or a good foot birthday centre mid? Yes, Koke. Which one is it? Oh, which one's that? I feel like that's the five-star skill one. I think. I think that's the five-star skill one. That's good, though. Koke's decent. What are we saying with uh, a dangler? Go on, foot birthday in there. Uh, icon is there as well. No, but Emerson Royale, it is the five-star skill one. Emerson Royale in there as well. Double informs. That is a cracking 85 times 10. That is an absolutely incredible 85 times 10. I can't lie. That is a really, really good 85 times 10. We happily take those. Two foot birthdays. Good fodder. Very nice. All right, Amy's got some fodder packs now. 81 times 11 and the 85 times 10. Ooh, gold normal in the 81 times 11. These packs aren't very good though. The 81 times 11s I'm not a big fan of. But the 85 times 10 hopefully should be good. Because they've been good so far. So fingers crossed. Here we go. Can we get Amy a good... Come on, Darwizzy. Give us Darwin Nunes. Ooh. That's not a good start. Klein heist. We're going to need either loads of high-rated fodder, like, like De Bruyne's, Benzema's, Neuer's, or we're going to need a foot birthday icon dangler. Very mid. Rubendish, but very, very mid. Right, we have an 85 times 10 to open, but before that, we have 380 plus player picks. Well, apparently are really good. Someone told me that these are actually cracked. So we're going to open these up real quick and see what they're like. Uh, the first one being an 84 is like pretty average. 83 there, pretty average. Go on, give us a foot birthday. Why not? I dare you. Now we'll take Rafael Leal. Very average, I'd say. Like, they're okay. A couple 84s is all right. But it's the 85 times 10 that we're interested in. Come on, EA. 85 times 10. Let's get let's get a foot birthday or foot birthday icon. Inform is not a good start. High rated one, at least. Palacios 88 or 87. We'll take it. But Danglas Central. Hmm... Only 385s. It's okay. It's a it's a very, very, very lowercase W for fodder. But apart from that, it's it's pretty bad. All right, Rex's year review player pick now. Come on. I don't even remember half of these cards. I'm not gonna lie to you. I, I literally don't remember half of these cards. Who the who is this? I don't remember him getting an SBC. Kalasnatch, Brand. I don't remember half of these cards, man. At all. Rammer's year in review player pick now. Zapata, the lucky Zapata right there for the Mbappe. Go on. Jacob Ramsey, is he good? I mean, so it was an objective card. Vanderton or Jacob Ramsey, is that a genie? I don't really know. Is that good? I feel like this is very personal. It solely depends on your team and if someone fits. If it doesn't, then it's a bit of an L. But if they do, then it's a W, if you ask me. Next year in review... Reese Oxford, again, is not bad. I didn't look at his stats before, but he can play at CB, I believe. Um, oh, wait. Is there two versions of this card? I think there might have been two versions of this card. Uh, but I've been told, apparently, he's really good. Ryan Kent is quite funny at the end. Radu. Uh, nah. All right. Amy's now got an icon player pick from submitting all her fodder. Let's see what we get. Welcome Jog was okay. He's got the five-star weak foot, I believe. Not an awful card, but it's not great. Again, it's pretty mid. Pretty mid. All right, we have an 85 times 10 now as well. Let's go. Bakayo's Beasts. We didn't have an informed Bakayo Saka this week, you know? Imagine you got Bakayo Saka right then. Thiago Almada, the Atlanta Wonder Kid. Um, let's see if there's any good danglers. Go on, foot birthday icon at the end of the pack. I mean, we didn't exactly get Mbappe out of a uh, year in review so far. But, like, you know... A cheeky little Mbappe in 85 times 10. You absolutely take those. You absolutely take those. Let's go, dude. All right, we have Dario's year in review player pick next. Come on, man. Ooh, Locatelli again. Apparently, he's really good. Like, after the last time we got him, like, everyone was telling me he's really, really good. So, 
Happy with that. That is a solid card, to be fair. We'll take it. We've got my boy Dean's year in review player pick next. Are we going to get our first player in the with Mbappe, Mane, or Pogba? Or Ramos? They're like the top four, apparently. Oh, we get Rabio. Maybe that's a sign. French. French Juve midfielder. Maybe that's a sign. Potentially. We're hoping. Come on. Next 80, 80 plus rare gold. No? Okay. It's going to be to Rebi. All right. Come on. Right here. What are the top dogs? What are the top dogs? What are the top four? What are the top, what are the top players? Anyway. Here we go. Come on. Ooh. Anthony Gordon. That's the highest rated version of him as well, actually. Musa. I didn't even know he had an SPC or an objective. Um, I feel like Gordon's all right. Simply because with, with Gordon, like, you just skipped all the grinding for him. You just get his best version. 450,000 coin birthday cheer pack contains a guaranteed mid icon with a 34% chance of a team of the week, an 8% chance of a foot birthday, and a less than 1% chance of a foot birthday icon. Imagine the double icon. Here we go. 2,500 thief points for a guaranteed mid icon. Who are we going to get? It's going to be Spanish, centre mid, Xavi, 90 rated. Not ideal. I don't care for this card at all. I feel like... Realistically, Hullet, Cruyff, Zidane, R9, you know, Pele, a few others are great. And then, like, I feel there's about 10 icons that are really good. And the rest are just kind of terrible. Um, but 90 rated Xavi is fodder. That is literally all he is. That is actually quite a really, that's a really bad pack. 450k. That is a terrible pack. Birthday cheer pack now on the Xbox account. Two and a half thousand FIFA points. Will it be for nothing? Or will we get something good? We've got a few good mid icons of this guy already. So let's see. Here we go. Mid Michael Owen. Wow. You know what? I didn't check how much Xavi was worth. Maybe, maybe it makes up the price of the pack. You know? Xavi is worth 137k. Brilliant. Mid Michael Owen is worth a whopping 67k. Awesome. Great. Doing really well here. Tony Cruz in there as well. Lovely. Wow. Awesome. Great. Let's go. All right. Next one now on the second PlayStation account. Here we go. Come on. Let's see a good nation here. Brazil, Dutch, French. Come on. Oh, it's going to be one of those days, is it? We're having one of those days today, are we? Alan Shearer. Brilliant. Informed opinion. No walkouts. 84 is the highest rated bar the icon. We're having one of those days, are we? Brilliant. Leon's year in review player pick next. I've just got to say yikes to that. I've got Apparently the last one had three out of four of them being objective cards as well. I don't know why objective cards are in this. I feel like it should be SBCs only, to be honest. All right, we have Jake's year in review player pick now. I don't know how many we've opened so far. We've had to have opened over 20 of these so far. Uh, I don't know who the best player has been, but we haven't seen one of, the, one of the best ones yet. Ooh, DRB that he doesn't already have. That's pretty good. Not having DRB already solid, he might be an Arsenal fan, so Vieira might be the one that's appealing to him. There's Traore there as well, but I think DRB's good if you've not already got him. He definitely has more upgrade potential as well. All right. 82 times 20. Carvalho's club. Can we get a foot birthday Darwin to go with this Carvalho? That's the question. Come on. It's an inform, not what you're looking for. It's Klein Dice as well. 85 rated inform. Not ideal. Maybe, maybe there's a dangler. Potentially. Neuer. Oh, one walkout. Oh, no. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, what a terrible pack that is. All right. A little bit of uh, content right here in terms of an 81 times 11. I think an 85 times 20 as well. It's going to be Van Dijk. 81 times 11s are not it. Do not waste a token on these unless you literally can't get anything else and you have one token left. You might as well. But like 81 times 11s are not it. Don't waste your time or your tokens on them, in my opinion. 85 times 10s are where it's at, though. In form, though. Oh. Oh, okay. Osserman. Could still be a dangler for birthday. So, there is still hope there. There's two dangler for birthdays. That's a good pack, man. Three three decent rated informs. Lewandowski and Cruz. And two foot birthdays. We'll take that. All right. We have another year in review player pick. What we said. Can we get a solid, solid pickup? Volderson right back's good. Vanderson and Danny Tobias aren't bad, to be fair. The other two are terrible. 
but Danny Sabaya is a decent looking card, and Vanderson right back is a good card. Will Graham Copwright get a good player from his 85 times 10? We want to see foot birthday or a foot birthday icon. Foot birthday, let's go. Ah, Lafon. Albon Lafon. Well, could be Danglers. Not a single, I was going to say not a single 85, but he's got 285 informs. But the rest is walkouts. That's actually a pretty good pack, though. That's not bad. All right, another year in review player pick now. Will we get our first Mane or Mbappe or Pogba or Ramos or someone like that? No, we won't. We get Jutkla, Bora, Khan, and Raul Garcia. All right, Swifty coming in with the content now. Let's see if Swifty can get something good. So 85 times 10. Let's see if he gets something good. Come on. Ooh, no foot birthday on the front. It's going to be Palacios. What are we saying for the rest of the pack? Come on. Let's get an icon. No icon in there, sadly. That is that is probably the worst one we've seen so far, actually. Last year in review player pick for the video. Can we end it off with a WEA? Come on. If you guys have enjoyed, please leave a like down below. Subscribe if you're new around here. Thank you all for watching. Cheeky little player of the month, Benjamin, to end it is not bad at all. And I'll see you lads later.